Hello everyone, Mystical Love and Light here. I'm going to be pulling a card of the day. And we are going to be reading the card right out of the book. The Wisdom of the House of Night. We're going to read it directly out of the book on what it says. to pick a card of the day. We will go down, 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 up underneath and pick a card. The moon. A beautiful black cat sitting under the moon in the moonlight. The moon. I'll put it right here so you can see the card of the day. Let's see what number that one is. Number 50. Hopefully you can see that. I need to set my camera up a different way where it's um, a lot closer. Or I need to go get my tripod. Because I just got a tripod for the paranormal stuff that I do. And I can also use it in here. Hello, Velvet. Come on. Come on. Okay. Ugh. And Velvet, I got her shaved up today. Well, actually, in three days, because she didn't like for me to do her head, so I have to just use the scissors on her head. So, I know, honey. I know. You're welcome. So, number 50. The card of the day. This is the sign that you must trust your gut your instincts and intuition will lead the way through the darkness okay and then it says when you choose the symbol of the moon as your guide you know that it is necessary to look beyond the obvious to know the truth of things sometimes people will say one thing and you have to and you have a weird feeling that they mean something else altogether. You have this power. You are being asked to use it now. Choose another card for a deeper look at what's really going on behind the scenes. So let's just do that then. We will pick another card. Mama, I'll have to put you down, okay? Okay? There you go. Good girl. We will pick another card because it says pick another card. shuffle that one back up into it. Well, we're going to do that again. Wouldn't it be something if we picked the same card and it said pick another card? That would be weird. to pick a card like underneath here way underneath here it was buried 
the card is differences and it's another cat two cats differences I'm gonna put it right here differences oh let me, what number is that number 36 and let's look in the book and see what number 36 says I always like doing cards I pull cards for me a lot just for myself number 36 differences choosing the symbol for differences ask you to accept that you will not always agree with everyone and they may not always agree with you as your goddess i have seen many things since the beginning of time know that the intricate differences between all beings are sacred and good you must learn to accept that others are not the same as you it's important to allow others to express their own opinions consider the difference between an orange and an apple both are fruit but they are different kinds is one more valuable than the other i think not all creatures all beings have a right to their uniqueness try to see and hear the other person's side if you can i like that card it's a very cool card okay thank you for watching and have a great day bye